Cindy roared ashore as a tropical storm with powerful winds and relentless rain along the Gulf Coast. The storm is now a depression, but it left behind knee-deep water in some neighborhoods, and Cindy is blamed for at least one death. Don Champion is in Mississippi with more on the aftermath. Cindy is no longer a tropical storm, but officials say it's still a threat to millions in Gulf Coast states. You can literally be in the sunshine uh, one moment and, and not long uh, thereafter, you're going to have strong winds and heavy rain. Don't let your guard down. The storm made landfall overnight in southwest Louisiana, packing 40 mile an hour winds and stinging rain. Downpours in Mississippi led to flash flooding, making driving dangerous. Some roads were even washed away. The rain made some people question their decisions to ride out the storm in flood prone areas. This is crazy. I will not stay a night again because where we was, the water was almost inside the camper. The lights went out. Here in Biloxi, the gusting winds and downpours mixed with brief periods of sunshine for much of the afternoon. Some parts of the area saw six or more inches of rain. To the east, winds damaged a ballpark and uprooted trees in Florida. Not usually one for loss at words, but I am now. I just, I, I can't get over this. In Alabama, where Cindy's impact was also felt, a homeowner left a special message for the storm. Don Champion, CBS News, Biloxi, Mississippi. And don't forget, you can get breaking weather alerts and live radar anytime on your phone or tablet with our free News 6 Pinpoint Weather app. Search WKMG in your app store.